For this experiment, you're going to need a very strong rare earth magnet like this one, an iron screw of some kind, and a power source which comes from a one and a half volt AA size battery. We're also going to need a small length of copper wire. Attach the screw to the flat end of the magnet and center it as best you can, like this. The more centered and balanced the screw is on the magnet, the better. Next you hang the screw and the magnet from the positive end of the battery. When you hang the screw and the magnet from the positive end, there's very little friction. Now you touch one end of the wire to the negative battery terminal, and hold it there, and then this is where the magic begins. Touch the other end of the wire to the magnet. Instantly, you created a homopolar motor, just out of a wire, a battery, a magnet, and a screw. Because of the very small amount of friction at the very top of the screw at touching the battery, this motor will spin for a very, very long time. There is a ton of really complicated science which explains exactly what's going on here. But thankfully, we don't have to understand that science in order to have some fun with this. Here are a couple of other variations on this theme. In this one, the wire itself is spinning around the battery. In this variation, I created a sort of cage out of wire. All the wires join at the top and touch the positive electrode of the battery. And the bottom end of the wires touch the magnet. And now it's time for you to try. Thank you.